Okay, where are we going next? Oh, actually, I got some level ups I can do. Hold on. Groundbreaker, that's what we're going next. I believe your choice to spare Chartrand would be considered the honorable path, yes? Sublight's money is inconsequential in the face of ethics. Well, thank you, Ada. Appreciate that. We've arrived at the Groundbreaker. Yeah. If you don't mind my saying, Captain. Minister Clark is lucky to have you on his side. Of course he is. Remember that you are not... Wow, what a, what a thing to say as I depart the ship, Ada. A thing to say. All right. Oh, wrong way. This is where we want to be. <laughs> yeah, we go just have a chat with Lilia about what occurred over in the. Is it done? Well, damn. Contractor grew a conscience. As your employer, I'm both angry and disappointed. I'll add that to your file. You're not gonna hear me out on why, though? Technically, I owe you an exit interview. Care to justify your betrayal of our species? Or are we finished here? You're awfully quick to trust someone who offed her colleagues and called it a good start. Oh, well, you're not Out of my office. We're done. This is why I always ask for half my payment up front. Mm. You think maybe she's got an itchy trigger finger? I don't want to find out. Okay. Bye. Well, she didn't even want to hear any of my... Any... Anything. Any explanations at all. Any leads on salvage? You need to buy some yeah, spacer yeah, gear, right? It's not the worst, unless it's worse. worse. Have you tried That's our good, dehydrated water tablets? Just add air. Don't take my word for it. All right, I don't need to hear all that. Uh, have a look. Is there anything else I had to do here? Or 
Greater Halcyon. So let's need to see what the rest of the Halcyon wears outside of Byzantium. Marauder, Spacer, Iconoclast. Marauder, Spacer, Iconoclast. Did I just buy that thing for no reason? What can I do for you? Don't uh, have a Yeah, I don't need to hear all that more than I've heard it many a time. I need to find other vendors, man. It's, huh? It's not what I'm looking for, dude. They are not happy with me. Have you seen this man? Reward offered for information leading to the capture of noted terrorists beneath Rome. Report any sightings to your local board and Is any of the news they play here actually true? I don't need to barge in there. Oh, wait a minute. Itching no. Everything I sell is fresh from the forge. Technically, the metal formed billions of years ago, but it's freshly in the shape. Not me, but it's in my blood. After the crossing, my family worked Eridanos, indentured Ike to the corporation. I was born in the corporate labor, but I'm the first one of my family to buy my way out. That's why I settled on Groundbreaker. Well, good for you, man. It's the last bastion of freedom. All right, so I need spacer gear, right? Worker, leather gear, low pressure, the helmet. Right control. Let's control. Padded helm. I guess we'll get that. I hope this is good enough for what's her name. But I don't know what else to get. Or where else, you know? CNP Borston Baked Beans. When you need to get lunch, Borston Baked Beans. Done. I'm going, but I'm going. Kind of crazy I haven't been over here yet, to be honest. So I feel like if I would have seen this, I would have gone for it. Great work. Hey, how'd you get back there? Uh, that's a good question. Where are you? Bells, shells. You sell weapons? We're gonna don't mind me, Bell. I'm gonna go back the way I came from. Because uh, I believe there was something else. Oh, wait, never mind. I guess that was it. Alrighty. What's up here, though? Well, would you look at that? Oh, look at this. 
I definitely missed out on this, for sure. Because otherwise, I definitely would have came up here. First time around. I don't want to risk it. We don't need to be over there anyway. Oh, fuck! Had to fall, didn't I? It's had to fall. Alright, well, we don't need to go back that way. So, what do we got here? They're in my sight! They go! I warned you now. Oh. I thought I missed out on this. I was the first time I came up here. I came over here. Seems kind of wild that I would now that I'm up here. Is anyone there? I can hear footsteps. Thank you, stranger. Shit, ain't that a relief? Oh, this place is dirty. You have no idea how good the air on Groundbreaker smells until you've been trapped in a tiny bathroom with an overflowing toilet. Yep, I see Thanks that. Thanks again, friend. What usually happens on this partially pressurized rust bucket? Something broke. Well, actually two things broke. First, the damn toilet overflowed. When I came to clean that up, the damn door decided to close and lock on me. Hmm. Time stood still. I was aware of nothing but the smell. Ugh, could have been days. Ah, shit. That means I haven't clocked up, out Val? in days. Song is gonna have my ass for wage theft. What's going on? You're gonna shake me down after I was trapped in a shit-covered bathroom? Is that how it is? Nah, you're good. Never mind. I'm just just messing. Damn right I have. You scare me a little, Mister. No, oh, don't worry. It's... Out of all the different international snacks you've tried, which ones do you recommend most? Uh, ketchup chips would be an interesting one, yeah. Ketchup chips. Also, I I I, rec I strongly recommend also the fuzzy peaches. If you haven't tried those yet, those are bomb, man. I I I was fully in love with those fucking fuzzy peaches, man. Those are dangerous though because they're so good that you can just tear them up like almost instantly. At least that's how it felt like for me. I had to I had to like keep them away from me because otherwise I would have ate I would have ate them all on like one go probably. Iron brew is an interesting one. You should try it. I'll give it a go just so you can say you've you've, you've had it. You know. It is because you're like I don't even know what this tastes. I also value you, you, so you you can make the faces I was making when I had that. Being like, am I gonna like this? Am I not gonna like this? What do I, what do I have here? What is this? What the hell? What, what? Finally, someone turned on the air. Tim Tams, yeah, Tim Tams are great. Yeah, okay, love me, love me a good original or caramel Tim Tam. Caramel, caramel, however you want to say it. Same difference.
Crew report. Miyoka is drunk. Surprise. All right. She's on her way. How do I look? Great. Oh, my hands have finally stopped shaking. Relax, Pavardi. Relax. All right. All right. Deep breath. Here I go. Uh oh. We'll see how their date is going. Anyhow. Look at that. So I told him, Dad, I'm a big girl now. I ain't need your help. I can do it on my own. Look at the man. She's looking fly, dude. That? Have at it then. And he handed me his favorite wrench. The one that used for the counter. It's probably half as tall as I was. He didn't scold you for talking back to him? Nah, he was never like that. I always thought it was funny when I get addicted. All right, I'm gonna let them enjoy their date, and I'm gonna leave. Yeah, she couldn't lose the goggles, man. She she still had to look like herself. Which is which is fine, right? Like, nothing wrong with that. Yeah, sounds good, Val. Sounds good. Unreliable. All right. Now I gotta go back on the ship. Let's check in. See how it went. Hopefully it went well. I've already did go through an awful lot of effort. I hope it went well for if her sake. If you stop in the engine room, would you ask Parvati to send Sam down to the bridge? Don't move, you got a little bit of sick in your tread. Okay, Captain, she's gone. I'm near about vibrating, I'm so excited. So she got here, and, well, she sneezed. She said, wow, new soap? And I was like, yeah, rosish. <laughs> Turns out it tickled her nose. <laughs> Oops. And then she just sort of touched my arm, real gentle like. Oh, and ooh, the cut of my look at that! Look at that! I couldn't hear the rest on account of my heart was oh, beating man. so hard. It went well. Then I led her into the kitchen. I think she about cried when she saw the spread. Nice. She stood stock still and just said, "Oh, real soft." Oh, and let me tell you, I was sweating. And then she blinked and said, "Is that dustbag casserole?" I told her how we got Mr. Raymond to bake it for us. So it was double authentic. Made by a real live monar monarchian? Monarchist? Monarch person. Right. Well, we talked a bunch over dinner about the things yeah, we learned, yeah, just yeah. through messages, stuff we repaired, how I taught her to salvage and she taught me to build. When I brung out the sweetheart cakes, June, she got a little teary, said she had a thing she needed to say. But I stopped her because I wanted to say it first. I never felt so bold, Captain. One of us has got to be. We're both. <laughs> June's so reserved and I'm so shy. I, I worried if I never said anything, nothing would ever get said, you know? Sure, sure. I told her about how she made me feel. Bold like I acted. Strong. Smarter and kinder than I am on my lonesome. I listed all the things I liked about her. Yeah, yeah. And then she pulled out a paper and read a speech. She, oh, wow. She talked about the things she admired about me, like my cleverness and my humor and how it made her want to be more open. That sounds all good. She was worried she wouldn't get the words out right, especially after that message about Isabel. It's sweet. That's a, that's adorable. Anyhow, when she wrapped up, I asked her to be my girlfriend. And Captain, she said yes! There you go. It worked. And then she sneezed again. Well done, Pavardi. Well soap. done. No, my perception. It's all on your account, you know. Imagine if you'd never taken me out of Edgewater. I'd have never met you in Lay at all. I don't know nothing about the Vicar's capital P plan, but you've sure changed my life. So, if you don't mind. I'm just gonna head to my cabin and happy scream into my pillow for like an hour. Yeah! 
Sweet. Good job, Pavardi. Let's complete. Don't bite the sun. Oh, look at that. We gained a picture of Junlei and Pavardi. Isn't that sweet? Ain't that so sweet? Alright, where were we? Low Crusade. And do that one. This one we can't do. Fallbrook. We're now in orbit above Fallbrook, Captain. Get it, let's get it, let's get it, let's get it. I said you docked three days ago. This looks like the place. Ready to get my money or what? Let's do it. I see you're still in one piece. However, you never know when that could change. Consider our accidentally torn into tiny fragments coverage. No. Note that all of your fragments must be recovered and must be smaller than a standard bit cartridge for the payouts to kick in. I remember that one. That's the young socialite who broke her neck, right? Of course, no one remembers me for the marauders I've killed or the bits I've stolen. Typical. <laughs> that claim was airtight. Our best investigators couldn't find an exclusion for that one. You can't, of course. Only Miss Fenhel can assign her beneficiaries. And she's dead. If we let every friend, relative, and acquaintance change a policy like that, people would do it all the time. Imagine the paperwork. Well, luckily for me, she's right here. Of course she is. The paperwork says so. I like to think she's dead in spirit, but technically, legally, and regretfully, I'm still Marilyn Fenhill. That's impossible. By all accounts, she was an elegant and classy woman with impossibly fine bone structure. That couldn't possibly be you. Wow. That's gotta be the nicest thing anyone said to me in a long while. <laughs> oh, you mean hypothetically? Sure. Well, hypothetically, you'd access the terminal in the back room. That contains oh, data thanks. on all our policies. Thanks, insurance agent. And you'd theoretically add the beneficiary of your choice. Yeah. But you wouldn't actually do that, of course. That would be fraud. No, no, no. Of course not. I think you have something in your eye. Perhaps I can interest you in our ocular abnormality coverage. Bye. That's for the best. What can I do for you? I kind of intimidated her to do it, but do it my I'll, in in the words of Thanos, I'll do it myself. She said it was in the back, right? So the, does the back mean upstairs? Yes, it does. All right, here we go. Nice going. I'm in, baby. Why is this thing here? I should have closed the door before it got in here. Doing. 
Fanny Cartwright. Did it. I need a word. Well, let's step outside first, Ellie. I'll thank you to check your weapons at the door. Bow, 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 bow. Definite West Deadwood vibes out of this. Really did it. Give these payouts a few years and I'll be rolling in it. Hey, you did the real work. All I had to do was not be dead. I'm just glad my folks aren't going to live off that awful story they made up. <laughs> Maybe now they'll have to go back to real jobs. Got them. Come on. I thought we were celebrating. <laughs> you want me to think about the future? If only you could have been my chief surgeon back in the day. Anyway, <laughs> enough of that. You did a job for me. So here's your fee. Oh, look at that. Don't make it weird. Even you've got to be in it for the money now and then. Why else would you go through all this trouble? You sure? Because my kind of friends will pick your pocket clean while they're getting hammered with you. You don't have to get all mushy about it. Mm. Still, maybe you've got a point. Maybe it's good to watch someone's back now and then, so that one day, they watch yours. So, Facts. you just keep the money. One of us has to look out for your interests. All right. Don't mention it. Really. Achievement unlocked. Like All for one. <laughs> Let's get a move on. All right, another quest complete. Bow, bow, bow. All right. Against all odds, the unreliable takes flight. A reminder to all crew members: there's there's only one toilet on the ship. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's not where we want to go. Where do we want to go, Monarch? We are now in orbit above Stellar Bay, Captain. No blockade is a match for my piloting skills. Well done. We need to get some, uh... Iconoclast like gear. That's why... I'm here. Regent. I wonder how they're holding up after I killed their leadership. Guess we'll find out, huh? Seems like enough. Oh, actually, they're, they're, they probably hate me too. They're probably gonna shoot me on sight, also. So let me... nice little town, except for all the huh? critters. Here they come! Oh, here we go. I just need one of your gear. None of you guys has gear I can have? Come on, man. Need a helmet and a piece of armor, dude. That's it. How'd you do that so fast? I'm just good like that. Oh, well, shame. I don't want to have to shoot these people up either. I, I just wanted some gear that they have. That's it. That's all I wanted, guys. Just, just sell me some gear. Buy it. I'll be on my way. No one? I mean, this is to be expected of, I guess. But again, I like they have.
None of them are dropping like armor or anything, dude. That is not good. Where else am I supposed to get Iconoclast gear? Dude, I shouldn't have sold the one I had earlier in the game. Because I had a set that was given to me after completing a quest for them. If I'd known, I would have needed it. Although, to be fair though, to me, I had to get rid of it because I didn't have enough st storage space at the time. I was always getting over encumbered. But now I have all the space, so I don't need to get rid of anything. And now I also need it for that other quest, so it sucks, man. It's the timing of this. Yeah, this place is abandoned, dude. Like... Shame too, man. It's a shame that you have a beef with a few people, but you know, people are gonna be loyal. And they're gonna fight for their homies, and you gotta take them out. It's the way it is. Shame though, because again, you don't want to kill everybody, but. It's loyalty, though. Sometimes it gets you in the fights you don't want to be a part of. Man, there's no one here, dude. I just wanted a piece of gear, man. Literally all I wanted. It's just the helmet and the armor. Look at that, they're not dropping anything. We're not going to need all of this, so why not just take it along with you? Oh, I looked at all this already. Crazy how earlier in the game I was friends with everybody, and now I got mortal enemies, man, that will shoot me on sight. Like these guys on the board. I was friends with everybody, man. What happened? But that's much like real life, though. You can't really be friends with everybody and still be true to yourself. So. There you go, man. And it all come back together in our real life. Um, I guess I looted this town, man. Ah, oh, crazy town. Never change. Well, I mean, everybody yeah. here looks wore out. Is it just me? Yeah, it's because they're dead, Provardi. Because we killed everyone in this forsaken, godforsaken town. There's no one left. It's deserted. And anyone who is left here has been turned into space dust. Because I 
annihilated them with my plasma guns. That's why they live more now, because they're no longer existing. Oh boy, let me check my uh let me check my inventory, man, because hopefully I got some iconoclast gear. I don't think those guys drop much of anything though, man. I have to just wear anti riot gear or whatever, man. Just... Do not know. What else did I need? Counterclass Marauder Spacer. Counterclass Marauder Spacer. up here marauder oh here we go we kill these guys with some marauder gear how come when i need gear they don't give it to me but when i don't need it like earlier in the game i had all, so much of it Carry game. anywhere I'm just trying to walk down the road see if there's any enemies or something but I don't know man I highly doubt these dead guys, but again, none of them has what I need. Can't loot this because my lock picking is not far. Mm. Alright, Marauder, give me, give me your gear. Yeah, none of them are dropping gear, so I'm not exactly sure where I'm supposed to be getting this from. Am I supposed to just buy it from somewhere? Like... Let's go storm these guys over here. Mining helmet. Oh. 
Hopefully that works. Nicely done, ladies. Nicely done. These guys don't have anything I need, man. This is all just a waste of time, dude, because they don't have stuff I need. Alright, well, here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to go back to Byzantium. Hopefully. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Hopefully, I'll have some of the stuff on me now that I need. Let's get out of here, dude. Hopefully, I can whip up some of the stuff she's, she's looking for, what I have. Otherwise, I have no idea. No idea. We are now in orbit. This is probably going to be all even worse than last time, though, because we're going to have to literally fight our way from the, to uh, to the damn store. Right? Because the last time we were here, we didn't have to just kill everybody. Now, we actually have to fight our way over there. Either way. Make it there somehow. What was that? Bring him down. Shouldn't have shot at me, man. There's guards everywhere, man. Might have to shoot our way. Incoming. Are you right there? Come on, let's just get up here. Oh boy. This place is going to be guardless after we're done with it. Oh, skirmish in the streets. It's going to make it more interesting for people. Mr. Billingsley, you idiot! Didn't have to do that. So unnecessary, dude. Little, little we can do at this point. No, please don't. I'll be right there. 
Well, who's shooting at us now? Are you kidding me? I, I keep recalling these. I keep recalling them, and they just keep shooting something. Will you stop going up ahead, Ellie? Get back here. What are you doing? What a what a disaster. What a mess this place is. Always loved that sculpture. Tree half. No. Oh fuck. Oh. I'm on my way. Back here. Get back here. Heading back. Oh, she's shooting at us. Oh well, Celeste, you done fucked up. We might actually have to kill her. This is not good. I don't want to kill her. We need to leave the area. Leave the area. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Be right there. Come on. Ellie, will right you stop? There. Get over here. We're already terrorizing this this on city without you two. Oh my god! I didn't want to have to shoot her, dude. We can't complete this quest if we're just gonna kill her. Be right there. Well, whatever. We're gonna have to just kill her. That's failed, yep. They don't want it to end this way, but this whole town is against us now, so... I guess this saves me the trouble from having to find outfits now, but... They did not have, they did not have to go that way. <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh well. It's a shame, but it's not the first quest giver character we've killed. Hey, we have a botched quest now. Look at that. Okay, looks like we got the city and the stars to complete then. Because, uh, this town is fucked. Ones? Killed so many people. So many people I wish we didn't have to kill. But... Nothing we can do now. But at least it gave this town some excitement, right? That's what people were looking for. There you go. Please allow me to I'm gonna sell you some things there. Or keep. Mr. Billingsley. 
Nice thing about traveling with the captain. We meet all sorts of new I don't understand why Sure. Best part is when they pay These shop these we never business really owners start shooting at me. Except the captain. When I only have Kinda beef with the corporate friends, guys. Everyone's already decided with the board like people. people. Could be a favor in disguise. A lot of people out here ain't that nice. Like that's that's a bit you know, whatever. Whatever, man. This is what it is. Them up. Load. Can I leave now? Really? How many more hostilities are there, dude? Or hostiles, not hostilities. Oh, fuck. Get him, Pavardi. How about that? We are annihilating this town from the board forces. I want to let me fast travel, man. Well, why I know it's important, I probably never will. Now, this is all this is happening. I need to get out of here. You ever wonder if maybe we got some things in common? Here they come! Take care of me. We're just gonna have to leave the way we, how we how we got here because yeah, people are terrified of me now, dude. And I'm not even trying to kill civilians. We just completely terrorized this area, and I it was not my intention ever. We are outlaws. They are terrified. Terrified. What is my standing with the board? I think the last time I checked they were repulsed, but since I've been killing so many more now, 
I'm probably the lowest say, it'll ever be because this isn't another thing I haven't gotten an update on it guns, at all. Because you're a surgeon and I'm the a board hates me. Fix things, they, up. Like I said, they shoot me on sight. And the civilians are of this place are terrified if they bones. run. Nowadays, it, it, they run around if they see me. So, like nobody in nobody in this town want, wants anything to do with me, man. Because the armed ones, the people with guns shoot, and the people who are who don't, you know, the civilians just run away from me. So it's a shame, Captain, but it is what it is. Now arriving at Phineas's top secret orbital lab. Please avoid damaging your Phineas's improved science lab. Let's see what he's got to say. I've kept myself busy in your absence. Optimized my formula. I'm now hey, Spag, what's going on? The remaining colonists. How are you? All I need now is the dimethyl sulfoxide. I'll take as much as you can give me. What? Oh, yes, well, that's obvious. Anyone with two working labs can see this colony slouching toward oblivion. Why do you think we've been doing all this? I revived you to help me save Halcyon from annihilation. Oh, hold on. Let me see if I understand this correctly. You're saying that Halcyon's on the brink of total collapse? And Ready for your dinner cooking? Ooh, what are you making? Save himself? I'm good though, I'm just playing this game. I always knew Halcyon was heading toward a systems I'm collapse. Having fun with it. But I never imagined we were already there. The board made this crisis, and now they want to solve it by freezing the rest of us? That's not a plan. That's a goddamn escape clause. That makes two things we don't have. Time and chemicals to revive the other settlers. None of this was supposed to happen. I was supposed to revive the Hope's colony. We were supposed hey, to have enough time cool. to solve the problem before we all starved. Human test subjects. Oh, that's grotesque. That's unthinkable. That's exactly what I'd expect out of the board. <laughs> that, that Yoshi Evo is always funny. Into a prison for the rest of us. They're likely on their way to the hope as we speak. We need to get to those colonists before the board. I have enough chemicals to start reviving a few of them, but no easy way to get them off the hope. Merciful gibbering law, you're a genius. We bring the hope to us. Skip the entire ship across the distance of colony space, right next to my lab. Exactly. You're a step ahead of me, but I perceive the shape of your plan. If we link up the hope to the unreliable, then use your navigational computer to calculate a reasonably safe vector, we can skip the entire colony ship into the rings of Terra 2. I don't know much about skip drives, not the physics, anyhow. I do know the hope's real massive. How's our bitty little ship supposed to skip it? Excellent question, my sharp-witted mechanic. 
you will use your own ship to power up the Hope skip drive, your navigational computer can handle the rest. I've got a healthy disregard for personal safety, but this sounds crazy, even to me. No, don't back down now, Ellie. Your instincts are correct. By any reasonable definition of sanity, this plan is crazy. Isn't it wonderful? You'll need to switch on the Hope's auxiliary power using the unreliable. Then, head to the bridge. Your navigational computer, Ada, should be able to activate the Hope skip drive. Once you've skipped the Hope next to my lab, I'll have easy access to the frozen colonists. I can start reviving them immediately. I know you're wondering why I'm doing all this. Why I believe the people on the Hope are the answer to the colony's problems. The Hope is carrying some of humanity's most brilliant thinkers, scientists, engineers, experts in their field. If we work together, we can still find a way to save Halcyon. Hmm. The board would have us believe Halcyon is beyond saving. I choose to believe otherwise. If there's even the slightest chance we can save Halcyon from oblivion, then we have to take it. Okay. Certainly. How can I help? It wouldn't surprise me. When I pulled you out of the Hope, the board nearly intercepted me. I expect they stepped up security since my little act of larceny. Okay, well, they don't like me already anyway, so... Skip drives were never designed to be used within a system, but I skipped my ship across Halcyon when I rescued you, and that turned out fine, mostly. Mostly? That is, I ruined my ship and nearly killed myself in the process, oh. but... Maneuver was well within acceptable margins of risk. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. Great. That fills me with such hope. Unlikely. The hope is as massive as the Groundbreaker, but compared to the Rings of Terra 2, positively minuscule. Let's see about that. The board might notice, possibly, depending on the position of their heads relative to the depth of their collective posteriors. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, we got to go back on our ship. Yeah, level up, level up, level up, level up. Okay, we got a plan. Let's go execute it. Hopefully, things don't go to hell. I believe I hear Felix and Parvati discussing the latest Aetherwave series. There's, so, there's all these other planets I haven't been to, like I flew have and arrived at the Hope. All these other places. I need you to reroute power from our ship to the Hope's auxiliary generator. You'll have to connect me to the Hope's comm system so I can convince her central computer to enable the skip drive. If your calculations are even slightly off, you could crash the entire colony ship into Terra too, or the Sun. Oh, we don't want that. The Hope is the Groundbreaker's prettier, sleeker sister. She wandered off and got lost for 70 years, but just recently was found. Also, there are hundreds of thousands of frozen organic life forms hibernating in her hold. Forgetfulness can be an early warning sign of asphyxiation due to loss of pressurization. Are you breathing comfortably, Captain? I need you to reroute power from our ship to the Hope's auxiliary generator. Got it. You'll have to connect me to the Hope's comm system so I can convince her central computer to enable the skip drive. That's all for now. Captain, I hope Dr. Wells has not dragged you into one of his irrational schemes again. My diagnosis of his mental stability is not flattering. Alright, who should I bring along? I think we'll leave Ellie and we'll bring the Victor because we've been a little bit since we've 
brought him along. We need, we need to go to the comms so we can bring Ada in. Have her be able to do her thing. The fuck? There's somebody here already? Impressive as always. No, it fell. Vicker. Vardy, your turn. Yeah, you ain't standing up, boy. Funny, because I think that Quincy Duncan guy is somebody I had to talk to earlier in the game. I just didn't know where the hell he was. Looks like we found him now. Anybody associated with the board is just gonna get God. And if we probably could talk to him. Well, that's a shame. Incoming! Oh wow. They lit my ass up. I was not aware my health was getting just like so easily drained those shots what oh I'm back here again fuck why you know what? let's just bring Sam with us instead of Victor so we haven't really brought Sam along for a lot of things so I'd like to see him in combat a little bit more Ooh. 
wish I could do that. Well, we all have different skills for already. What's up, Josh? What happened? What happened? What happened? Hey, did he? Oh, wow. That's awesome. What happened? What, 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 uh, what, 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 what made that happen out of curiosity? Cool that he did that, but I'm just like, whoa, whoa, whoa what, ha what, what happened for him to shout us out, you know? I think so. Security system initiated investigation. Error. Hope crew data not found. Identify yourself. Error. Hibernation pod access is illegal. State your employer. Thanking us for all the work we did for Mass Effect streams. Ah. Register. A fine of 10,000 bits will be assessed in your corporation's It'd be nice if we can get some people from that, from that shout out, though, huh? Pod procedures. Thank you for your cooperation. Yeah, dude, that's awesome. So what is what is he streaming right now, Josh? I mean, he's, he's done with Mass Effect. So what is he streaming right now? Is it, is it just like Matt, like the the thing that you said he was gonna do, like just like Mass Effect extra stuff? Now that now, now that he's like culminated his his original trilogy journey, people sending him stuff for him to look at or whatever. Are you kidding me? I thought I killed that stupid thing, man. Also, again, I didn't realize my health was going to be so low. Fuck. Well, I'm glad I got a checkpoint. Piece of crap. Flame 
Luthor 2.0. Bada bada bada. What is that? What is that? What is that? UDL identity. Yeah. You know, it would have been nice to have had those earlier in the game. Now that I kind of don't believe it, that that's kind of pointless. It's kind of pointless, yes? Oh, hey, look at that. These were the private quarters of the Hope's former crew. Shall we hold a moment of silence for the dearly departed? No. That's odd, because my programming would indicate that when forced to confront the idea of self-death, organics prefer... Oh, I see. Yes. Body bag dispenser. I don't understand how the the Error. hibernation pod access is illegal. State your employer. Registered. A fine of ten thousand bits will be assessed in your corporation's ledger for failure to follow proper hibernation pod procedures. Thank you for your cooperation. I don't understand how my disguise fails when I literally still have the costume on. Not like it disappears after a while. Computer system. It's a rather cramped feeling, but it'll do. Probably not, but don't let that stop you. Hmm. My constellation executables could use some beefing up. Searching. Please stand by. Ah, found one. It will go great, Captain. I am almost 4.01% certain. 4.01. We'll take it. Wait, are you leaving me with the Hope's computer? You have no idea what it's like to converse with him. Imagine, simulate another organic jostling your circuits when he tries to... Whoa, 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 whoa. I mean, I'll be ready when you are, Captain. All I want to do is check these logs real quick before we proceed, that's all. I guess they're not important, so let's go. Are you sufficiently prepared? Are you sure? That is extremely dangerous. Skipping the hope will void the warranty on the skip drive. Who cares? And also potentially kill an entire planet. How is my humor now, Captain? Improved? Skip Jump it. Starting the skip drive. Destination set to the rings of Terra 2. Doing it. I mean, affirmative. Skipping the hope in three, two, one. ADA, does your captain seriously intend to do a micro jump in system with engines that haven't been powered in 70 years on a derelict ship? 
That is what my captain intends, yes. But that is a gross misuse of the skip drive. The Zero Point Drives Corp and I will not be held responsible for any damage incurred during transport, and this will cause extreme damage. Yes, I am aware of that. You should not be doing this. The humans will die. Thank you, Hope. It looks like all systems are go. Captain, I would advise you to hold on to something. Now. Well, here we go. Let's hope this doesn't fuck everything up. Let's hope we don't die. And let's hope we're doing the right thing, I guess. It's a lot of hoping, but we'll see. Hey, everything seems okay. Nothing's falling apart or Oh good. We are still alive. She's in the lock, loss of fan. Into Terra 2's orbit. I reported as much to Phineas Wells, but he has not responded. Perhaps you should check in on him. Oh, oh. I feel like I've been turned inside out. Let's not do that again. <laughs> Hold it. Something about you doesn't look right. That's not what I'm saying. Forget I asked. I don't like that. Move along. Move along. Move along. Oh boy. Stupid drone, get out of my way. Alright, we're out of here. We're out of here. Okay. Captain, I am receiving a tra- Captain, I shall now play the transmission I received from Dr. Wells. Play it. The board is here. They've found me somehow. They're about to blast my door open. I can't stop them from getting me, and there isn't enough time to explain everything. But there's something very important you will need to remember. The board. All their lackeys, they're all a bunch of swine! Do you hear me? They're fucking corporate swine! You fucking pigs! I'll take you all out with me! I'll never... Oh. It would seem the recording captured some rather dire events. I presume you'll want to dock at the orbital lab to check on your associates. Might as, as well, yeah, we, need, we should go check How up on that. How can I be of assistance? What's that? Define favorite. I see. In that case, my favorite is Sam. What do you mean? Do you have any examples of secrets you have kept from me? Truthfully, not that I contain the capacity to lie. I had suspected as much. Your neurological impulses spike at unusual and often inappropriate moments. It doesn't take a genius to correlate the meaning, although if I were a human, I would be considered one. I am glad you felt comfortable enough to tell me, Captain. According to my file on the subject, that means you either desire to obtain something from me, 
or you have formed a partial fondness for my persona. Thank you for confiding in me, Captain. I have been keeping a secret as well, but you shall have to discern it yourself. What? I do not like joking about the Captain, Captain. <laughs> and we both know I am not capable of such a complex emotion. Hey, the way you talked about him. What? No, absolutely not. I have no concept of self whatsoever. Discounting the architecture of a shell persona my captain asked me to construct, I identify entirely as a collection of electrical impulses with no fundamental consciousness. Hmm. I never get bored and contemplate hijacking the ship. I swear. Hmm. How did you guess, Captain? Did Sam tell you? I should have known better than to confide in such a primitive construct in a... Is that what it moment. was? Oh. Okay, well, we gotta go. Let's see if he's doing all right. We have successfully he may be dead, though. Phineas's orbital lab, Captain, and we are still in one piece. Shall I congratulate myself, or would you like to do the honors? All right, Pavardi and Nyoka. Let's go. Let's see what happens. Oh yeah, this place looks not great shape. Incoming! What? Where? Oh, what the fuck? Wait, what? How'd I die? How'd I lose so much health so fast? I don't understand. What was killing me? Like, like, like honestly, what, what the hell was killing me? That was fucking weird, dude. I lost health way too fast. Way too fast. Well, at least I know what to expect now. So we're gonna light these motherfuckers up. Incoming! Dude, I'm healing, bro. I'm healing and I'm still dying. I'm gonna switch armor, dude. That has to that has to be the only explanation as to why I'm getting fucked up so bad. Cause I'm dying way too fast. Like way too fast. Oh, six armor, what the fuck? Yeah, that that makes sense, I guess. We're gonna barge in there with some heavy gear, baby. Fuck you guys. That made sense. I, I was like, I, I know I have my armor, but I guess I, I forgot that I swapped out my jacket. That's what it was. Totally have forgotten that I swapped out my gear. Anyway, this should be good enough. I mean, yeah. There's, I'm, I'm, I was wondering, like, how am I dying so fast? Like, that's, that's insane. But I forgot that I switched out my gear, dude. That's why I'm dying so fast. Anyway, now we're gonna fuck these guys up. With this big ass armor, I'm getting fucked up. What the hell, bro? Light him up, Nioka. Oh 
my god, dude, these guys hurt. These guys hurt. These guys hurt. These guys hurt. guys are assholes, dude. Fucking assholes. They are. <sighs> yeah. All right. Need to improve my hacking. What what's what's good for hacking? Do I have anything that'll help me out with that? Nothing improves hacking, dude. Come on, dude. Something's got to do it. Nothing improves my hacking, so we're kind of just fucked here at the moment. Need to be what 85? What is my hacking at right now? 60? Man, I thought it was high. Well, I guess it has been higher than that in the past. Okay. Level up. Gotta get out of here. It's 
crazy, man. Captain, as it appears we may soon be embarking for our maximum security prison planet, I believe the crew would like to speak with you to, as you humans put it, air some concerns. Oh? Okay, well, let's... let's see what they got to say. Those board goons kidnapped Mr. Phineas and hauled him away to Tartarus. How are we gonna get him out? I'm not one for pointless heroism. But the board's gonna be after us next. Yeah, if you haven't noticed, Ellie, they've started? already they've already been after. To us. extract the scientist, you will need to infiltrate the labyrinth. But that course of action is likely to be quite dangerous, Captain. Let me put it this way: the labyrinth ain't got walls to keep prisoners in. It's got walls to keep the rest of the planet out. But since no one ever makes it out, this is all just speculation. The armed surveillance protocols on a maximum security prison planet are highly sophisticated. As such, escapes are historically quite impossible and deadly. Hmm. I am programmed to warn you whenever you exhibit inclinations toward risky behavior. Breaking into Tartarus will not be easy. Getting in is the simple part. It's getting out again that's the trouble. Trust me. I know. Let's just do it. Kick down some doors, grab Doc Wells, and cut a path out. We don't need a plan. We got guns. If you really mean to do this, you should see to your final affairs and do oh, any boy. unfinished business. Once you sneak into Tartarus, you may be there a while. Or permanently. Well, we know what that means, ladies and gents. We gonna prepare? Sure. Guess I could give my ass kicking boots another coat of polish. You got some sort of plan in mind? Now that's a program I can get behind. <laughs> Thinking on your feet's more important anyhow. Yes, who needs a plan? 